The future of energy storage. Within the next 10 years, experts predict that global energy consumption will have almost doubled what it was in 1990. By this time, we will have been generating electricity commercially from renewable sources for more than 50 years. However, to truly replace our current system with green alternatives, we not only need to increase production, but also come up with adequate storage solutions for surplus energy. Batteries. Batteries are something we use in our daily lives. However, the batteries needed to store the energy generated by renewable sources need to have a large capacity and a long life. We use a lot of lithium iron and lead batteries, but scientists have also been working on new vanadium redox batteries, which could store up to 100 hours of energy. Pumped hydro storage. In places where hydroelectric power can be generated, such as mountainous regions or waterfalls, there is a possibility for pumped hydro storage to be used. As water naturally runs down the slope of a mountain, it can generate electricity. However, by using a little of the excess energy to return it using a pump, we can then allow it to run back down again, generating yet more electricity. This method of storing energy is great because it has very little impact on the environment. Hydrogen energy storage. Now, even remote places that are off the grid can have access to an electricity supply. This method works by solar panels on the roof, collecting energy from the sun. Any excess energy is stored as hydrogen in tanks until it is needed later to generate electrical, thermal or light energy. Energy Storage Tower An energy storage tower is an idea from a company in Switzerland. This idea is similar to pumped hydro storage, except it can be done without any water. The tower has a large crane in the center and a lot of concrete blocks. With surplus energy, the crane builds a tower with the blocks. Then, when energy is required, the kinetic energy from lowering the blocks is transformed into electrical energy. It might sound like a strange idea, but it's as efficient as a lithium-ion battery and is a safe and cheap storage solution. Compressed Air Energy Storage CAES. Another solution to store energy without water might be to use air instead. After all, there is plenty of it around. To store energy with this method, ambient air is pumped and compressed into an underground chamber. At times of high demand when energy is required, the pressurized air is heated and expanded through a turbine. This drives a generator and produces electricity. So which of these energy storage solutions will we be using in the near future? A combination of all of them seems the most likely outcome, with preferences being influenced by geography, location and cost. <laughs>